channel it is Kylie dreams and today I am going to do a jeans haul I cannot get enough of jeans I love jeans just because like jeans come in different styles the way they fit I got some jeans from pretty little things Zara and Fashion Nova I feel like those three gives you like a little variety just depending on you know your budget and what you're looking for and I got some unique jeans to show you guys. So I wanna show you guys some unique pieces that I have, okay? Okay, so the first pair of jeans that I want to show you guys is these jeans from Pretty Little Thing. I got it in a size eight. I feel like I am a size six, seven. So I went up a size eight and it fit perfectly because at first I bought a size six and the jeans are pretty stiff. So whenever you have jeans that hardly have any stretch, you should go up a size. And then you kind of have to know your own body type to know, you know, will it be loose in the waist? Will it be too tight in the waist? So all that plays a factor. Now up here, it's still a little bit loose, but I didn't want it too constricting for me. Pretty little things, they kind of leave a little bit of waist open compared to Zara jeans. They're tight in the waist and then it gradually goes down. So I got these because it has like these cute little rips in it and I can do like an edgy style or I can wear a button up and tie it and it will be really cute. Right now I don't have any heels on. I'm 5'2 and it's coming up right at my belly button. Um, it drags on the floor a little bit like just a little bit it drags on the floor but like if I'm wearing heels it'll be like a perfect fit because I love a flush jean. But yeah these don't have a stretch. These are kind of like a midwash. Uh, jean and I was just loving the edginess of the pants and the rips and I felt like it wasn't too long it was like the perfect length for me so I just wanted to show you the back so you can see what it looked like as well and on the left side it has well my left it has three rips and then one rip right here which is super cute and I'm gonna try to wear the same shirt when I'm wearing the jeans just so that you guys can get a, a feel for them. I didn't want to change the top. I just wanted to have you guys focus on the bottom. And these jeans, they don't constrict my butt too much because where I've noticed like with Zara jeans, which we'll get to um, as well, they're tight right here. They're tight all around here. And sometimes if you don't pick the right size, it'll constrict, constrict your butt in your waist. Okay, so the next jeans that I have is from Zara. Zara jeans are so beautiful. I can't really describe it, but Zara jeans just have the perfect cut. Now, just like when I had the Pretty Little Thing jeans, I'm usually a six, seven, so I went up a size because it has no stretch. And with the Zara, they are very tight in the waist. Look how beautiful, look how beautiful it cinches in right here. It doesn't have the gap like the Pretty Little Thing. It just perfectly seamless right here and it goes down and I love these jeans it's a perfect color I think you can get them in a darker denim and it has the frayed ends to them like it, a pretty little thing had a frayed end to it too but this one does as well and because it had the fringe ends I actually cut like an inch off because like I said I'm 5'2 and it was like this long so I actually cut an inch off so you have to be careful so what I did is I folded it and then I just cut it with those sewing scissors those thick sewing scissors that your grandma used to have that you could like stab somebody with but anyway these are amazing and I made the mistake of getting true to size so then I started doing some reviews I started looking on YouTube and they say go up at least two sizes. You have to go up two sizes, unless you have like a tremendously skinny waist. No matter what, you still have to go up two sizes because it just cinches in right here, but oh my gosh, it fits so good. Like, like I would say don't even worry about the size because don't look at the number, you know, like when you're like, oh man, um, I'm a size eight or I'm a size 12 because you have to go up two numbers. Don't worry about that. It's just the styling of how each company do their jeans, you know. So don't worry about the number. Just 
think about how beautiful the jeans are so uh -huh. I love Zara jeans like um I actually had another pair but it was the first pair I got because it was the one that didn't fit so I had to rebuy re it again and get the size that I wanted and it fit perfectly so I'll show you guys probably in my part two all right so these jeans are from pretty little thing and what caught my eye was that these were so different I first got them in a size six but of course you know I know to go up a size um I got them in a size eight and these are really cute so they have this color in black and they have a lighter color I think this is more of like the mid color so they have like a light one and this one in black and I decided to get this this color is typically what I go for I go for like the mid wash or kind of like the light to medium wash and I think these are cute out of this just so different I don't have any heels on I'm just kind of like standing on my tippy toes just so you guys can see it and the split goes all the way to like my hip bone and it fits really good it's really tight around here but it's not that bad at first I was like I don't know how this will look but I have to try it because it just was different you know when I'm looking at jeans I'm like hmm do I have these jeans or do you think this will look good like I just try to picture myself and what I'm gonna wear with it this one I really wasn't sure what I would pair this with as far as the top but I know that I will find something this is actually some good jeans to wear in the summertime like if you don't want to be too hot you can just let your legs out <laughs> it has the split legs it's so cute and it, it look it kind of reminds me of like the 70s okay so these next jeans are from house of chic LA the owner is a black business small business owner um, her name is Tawana and she has been having her boutique for a while now and I've always loved her fashion I feel like her fashion is kind of like my style it's kind of chic it's um, classy um, a little bit edgy sometimes sexy so I really love her items I'll link all the um, um, places where I got my items below my jeans so I love these mom jeans they are like a dark wash but has like a little light in it and has a bit of fringe on the side it's something that's pretty simple um, usually like with this I wear a blazer or um, I'll have like a button up and I'll tie it um, or like a little headband or something and it's one of those effortless type of looks and what I like about this is it's very comfortable it, it's not as hard of a denim as the other ones this one kind of has a slight stretch to it not a big one but I can move around in it even though it cinches right here I feel comfortable and of course it comes to my belly button um, I really don't have like low-ish jeans I really love the ones that like kind of fit right here it just gives a good feel to them and um, it touches the ground very slightly but of course when I wear heels it will be better and it fits really good all the way around all right so these next jeans they're from Fashion Nova and they are the split jeans right here now I just threw these shoes on it's not for like style or anything I just want you guys to focus on the jeans and I love these jeans <laughs> I just feel like it's something simple but adds a little flair to it I got this in a size six and I wore these heels just so that you could see it fully through just so you can see the split at the bottom I'm going to move back a little bit just so you guys can see it these are like one of my favorite jeans I love these these are light light wash jeans they have some other colors that are a little bit darker um gosh sometimes I wish I was just like a little bit taller but look at that these are so cute I wanted to switch up the color because I'm always wearing like these darker colors so I decided to have like a light wash jean and it fits perfectly like these jeans I didn't go up to like a size 8 because it has a stretch to it it has a really good stretch to it and so I didn't have to do all of that this really fits comfortable and I love the fact that they have like different colors and stuff I wanted to show you guys a variety because we all have like <laughs> we all have like a jean style but I'm pretty open like I'll wear almost anything as long as it looks good the only jeans that I'm not 
really into is like the low waisted jeans. I mean, if it comes back in style and there's one that really looks good, then maybe. But right now, I haven't found any. So what do you guys think about these styles? I'm going to tell you one thing for sure. I'm buying more Zara jeans because they are absolutely amazing. The only caveat about that, the only drawback is that they're always long. So it's something where you have to wear heels. But luckily for me, I had cut mine or you might get lucky and find some of the petite. If you are a petite person, if you're tall, you okay, okay? But when I tell you the Zara jeans, when I say like the cut and how it like cinches in your waist, beautiful, beautiful. And then like with Pretty Little Thing, I say that they have unique jeans. I really love them. And then Fashion Nova, um, they're more fast fashion where I would say that they're, there's nothing really special to them. They're, they're, they're cheaper made. And of course like Zara, but there's levels to this. You know what I mean? You first start off with Fashion Nova. It just depends on your budget because of course Zara costs a little bit more, but it's for quality jeans. And when you have jeans, they last forever. They last forever. Jeans, if you look it up, jeans aren't really meant to be washed every time that you wear them. You can wear them a few times and then wash them. You know, so jeans are just made to be wearable and to get that wear and tear into them. Um, so that's just, that's just what I heard, you know.